5 Tips with Ion Engines Number 1. Endurance The Ion Engine combines electrical charge and xenon gas for propellant. While extremely efficient, its small amount of thrust makes it only practical on small spacecraft. Firing your engine will quickly deplete your battery, so it's a good idea to have solar panels or isotope generators to restore your electrical charge. When testing your probes on the launch pad, keep in mind that the pad itself will recharge your vehicle slowly. Nevertheless, it's still a good idea to test these craft on the pad, ensuring your electricity is recharged fast enough. Notice how I'm draining power faster than these panels can restore it. In direct sunlight conditions, a large panel will continuously feed an ion engine. You may however find yourself needing two large panels to maintain your center of mass. Number 2. Burn in the Sun Solar-powered ion spacecraft can be somewhat difficult to maneuver, as you have to plan to do your engine burns in the sun. To accelerate the slow process of ion engine burns, it can be a good idea to use physical time warp. Keep in mind that even in direct sunlight, each ion engine needs a large solar panel to continuously burn. Number 3. Baby Steps because of their small amount of thrust, it's often a good idea to do each maneuver in steps. This becomes particularly evident if you ever have to do an engine burn in the dark where your solar panels cannot replenish your electrical charge. Plan to only complete a portion of your maneuver and continue burning on it each time you orbit. Remember ion engines are about fuel efficiency, not haste. Number 4. Probe Drain Keep in mind that computer-controlled probe brains will also eat away at your electrical reservoir. It can be a good idea to include radioactive isotope generators to restore your control of the probe if your battery should be completely drained on the dark side of the planet. Number 5. Radioisotope Two radioisotope generators will run one ion engine indefinitely. This can be an excellent alternative to solar-powered ion probes. On this craft, notice there are no batteries. However, having two generators per engine will keep the engines running even after my electrical charge is depleted. The fact that this particular spacecraft is manned is why I still have control with no electrical charge. While most practical for small space probes, they can also be handy on small spacecraft or even used as emergency engines on your larger spacecraft. Thanks for watching. Join me next time for 5 Tips with Sky Cranes.